Hello everyone, I'm Bruffy1322 and welcome to Wreckfest. Now, this is my first proper Wreckfest video on my main channel, but I've played Wreckfest for quite a while over the years, just not very often. Uh, if you go to my second channel and search for Wreckfest, there'll be some sort of regulars streams that we did where it was, you know, just an hour or so with a small number of people and we'd get in and do a bit of Wreckfest. There's some clips from those streams, sort of crazy happenings, you know, in, in terms of some random videos there. But yeah, with me sort of not necessarily moving away from GTA, but wanting to diversify my content a bit alongside GTA racing, Wreckfest seems like a perfect thing to do. It, it's incredibly good fun. There's a variety of cars, a variety of tracks, a variety of things that you can do with it. We're going to obviously take a bit of time to get up to speed. I've been streaming Wreckfest for the last few weeks, mainly doing a bit of single player stuff just to get myself, you know, reacquainted with the game. And this is video from the footage, the footage that you're seeing for this video is basically from the very first stream, you know, proper mainline, it was on a Saturday morning, proper Twitch stream where we had a full lobby of people and just did some interesting racing. And, and basically with this first stream, the idea was to do a bit of everything, so a few small races on a tarmac circuit, a dirt circuit, a mixed circuit, things with crossovers and you know carnage, basically a, a little bit of a taste of everything that Wreckfest has to offer. This timestamps in the description as well so if you can you know so you can skip to wherever you want. And then the plan is to just continue this forward, you know, do more races. I want to do some event style races. The next thing I'm gonna do is a sort of a car v car. Um, it, well, attempt to do that anyway. Uh, that we, you know, the, the GTA car v car things that we do, attempt to do that in Wreckfest, and also bring some of the unique GTA racing experiences that we do on GTA over to Wreckfest as well, because I think it's a it's a good place for that. So, yeah, like I said, it's going to take some time to get acquainted with everything and accustomed and get up to speed as well. Obviously, I'm not as quick on here in comparison to the quickest guys as I am on GTA, but it's going to be a lot of fun and I hope you guys are gonna enjoy it and come along for for the ride and if you've never seen Wreckfest hopefully this video can give you a bit of an idea of what you can expect for Wreckfest content on my channel in the future thank you guys hope you enjoy so if we're gonna do rally cross rules when it comes to contact it would be a case of like contact is okay but only within reason like rally cross you get a bit rough and ready you know you can you can um you know go in a little bit quicker and use someone as like the outside as long as you're not ramming into them for example i don't think we should do full-on like proper racing rules like we do on GTA, non-contact and all that kind of stuff. You know, it's, it's still wreckfest, we still gotta have some ability to have some wrecking. But I don't think we should have intentional takeouts. Some wrecking and some festing. <laughs> well, it depends on the type of track, obviously, as well, I suppose. You know, if we're doing a figure eight crossover track or something, then it's going to be absolutely fine to do some wrecking. Different tracks are going to require different rule sets, I think. Dodgy. 
last lap. We're in eighth. Oh, I need to find a new location for um, me as well. I did have a location. Um, uh, when we did breakfast on the regular streams, I think, didn't I put myself like middle right I think oh is it left can someone go check back on one of the patreon streams the regular streams and see what we had I think whatever I had that was a good location I can't remember whether it was left or right It was either left in between the map and the timer in the top left, or it was on the right above the speedo. Yes! Two positions at the end! Actually, more. I'm in sixth. Fifth! Top five's always possible! Yes! <laughs> Top five's always possible. We're only doing... We're doing Wreckfest. And it's still true. <laughs> yeah, that hasn't worked. Reverse order from the last one. Don't know what performance points is. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, it's going to be carnage. Oh, it's carnage. It's... Oh, username's gone. Username's absolutely gone. <laughs> carnage. Oh, my days. <laughs> this is fun. This is still cleaner than Project Homecoming. Still cleaner than Project Homecoming. Oh, no. Oh, no. So we're on an all dirt track this time. The next track we'll do will be mixed, so tarmac and dirt. Then we'll try to bring in some crossovery crazy stuff. We're just gonna we're just gonna do a mix of a bit of everything in this this first stream, trying everything out, giving it all a go. Gotta learn some tracks as well, really. Big overspeed there. <laughs> See, with something like that, I feel like you just take it. When it comes to like figuring out how we're gonna do the rules of racing sort of thing, like I hit him in the back, but it wasn't exactly right into the corner. It was just a little nudge. It wasn't a massive, I feel, and then at the start, obviously it was carnage. You know, we're not going to have anybody wait for stuff like that, I don't think. Damn, he's quick in that. Up front. Oh, no. Oh, I got massive un understeer. Oh, I'm gone. I'm gone. Back behind bloody squirrels again. I should probably tune up some cars to like get them to be on the top pace for each class or whatever. Oh god, that was a bad hit. That was a bad hit.
Oh yeah, I've lost the spoiler. No traction anymore. Traction boost's gone. <laughs> no, Wreckfest's actually a good game that doesn't have silly mechanics like that. At least I think. I would assume <laughs> that that would just be uh, vi visual. Okay, I don't think top five's gonna happen in this one. Almost big bonk. They're going for a top ten though. I think we've got twenty-three people. It's been a good turnout for the first bit of breakfast that we're ever doing. As in multiplayer or like in a full stream of multiplayer, I guess you could say. That's alright. If I'm going to get damaged, let it be on the last corner of the last lap. <laughs> Damn, that lap time difference. 101s from those guys. In comparison to me languishing with a 106. Much to learn. Oh, further to the back this time. I love this car, though. It's my favourite car. I love this car in real life. I don't have the Super Venom, I really want it. <laughs> that was quite the dive, but it did, it was that was I would say something like that's just totally fine. Like he didn't take anyone out. Oh god, there's some takeouts though. Oh there's some takeouts. Yep. 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 We're still alive. We're still alive. Oh no, come on. Come on. <laughs> hey, we gained a decent number of positions there though. You okay? You just showed the dog. Yeah. Aww. <laughs> oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> Everyone's learning the track. <laughs> oh, it's all right. Take advantage. Not quite. Big gaps already. Like we're only we're only a lap and a half in, nearly two laps in. And looking at the map, there's just people everywhere. <laughs> I'm looking forward to like getting more to grips with the game being a bit like quicker and better understanding things a bit more um, and doing some proper events I can't wait for a car v car it's gonna be I think that would be really fun on Wreckfest we can do rally cross type stuff as well there is at least one track that allows that we can just have a boatload of fun with this game I think it's the perfect transition from GTA like GTA is not going anywhere, but the fact that we have another outlet for some fun racing, it's going to be great. Wreckfest has perfect physics as well. Like for, for an arcadey, off-roady, recce type racing game, like I wouldn't mind if GTA handled like this. That's super venom. Mr. Brazzle King's in. It's so fast. 
I want one of those. Finally, not gone too wide on that first corner. Well, to the extent that I have in the previous races. Hell. <laughs> the Venom, the Super Venom is bloody quick, isn't it? It's just a better version of this. This is the fastest car I have for the minute. It's the only one I've fully upgraded. Oh, too wide. I'm gonna keep seventh. Okay, I just noticed I need to move the camera down a little bit now. We've gone too far up, too far for, too far up. Only 700. Ooh, starting at the front. I'll take that. I'll take that pole position spot. But we're on a crossover track this time and there's like four points of potential crossover hitting and stuff so this is going to be an interesting one like i say we're mixing up the tracks we're getting more and more crazy as you know each track goes so we're doing a fairly mundane crossover track first next time we're going to do a proper crazy crossover track and then we've also got stuff like ovals and things we can try out. One of the weekly or daily challenges was on this track, I seem to remember. Crossovers will come in soon, I'm sure. Damn, we had a better line through there. Oh, wait, is that the way you can? <gasps> you can skip the jump? No way. We got people who know what they're doing. <laughs> I am not one of those people. I need to remember to try to angle myself off that jump. Come on, get up the inside. <laughs> Dirty jump skippers. We got run skippers on G-Fred in Wreckfest, we got jump skippers. I mean, I'm gonna try it. <laughs> I made it work, but Fergie didn't. <laughs> oh, it's quite risky though, I feel like, unless you've done it a few times and you know exactly what you're doing. Like, I feel like that could have gone very badly, very easily. I just think there's gonna be a period of like, I still forgot to angle myself for that. There's going to be a period of acclimatizing, you know. GTA, we know how how it all works. We know what the fastest cars are. Oh, that was close. <laughs> um, you know, we've 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 gained nine years worth of knowledge about the game and racing and stuff. Wreckfest is going to take some time to learn the tracks, learn all the tricks, learn the quickest cars, learn how to be quick driving as well, to be able to compete with, you know, some of the guys who are quick already. So, we'll have fun until that happens, but 
You know, I don't, and there's no way I have the pace of Rider B in this one. But, one last corner to go. I'll absolutely take a second. That's my best result so far. To be fair, it was only because of uh, uh, the starting position, I think. <laughs> but I'll take it. Second for life. My first second for life with Regfest. I was a second pair lap slower. But at least that's, that's a bit better than I was in the previous races. A bit closer this time. All right, here we go. It's about to get a bit more recce. See, on a track like this, there ain't no rules. It's just survival, isn't it? Just as for vans. Let me through. Oh, this is going to be painful. Oh, if I'd stayed to the left, it would have been all right. Din might try his best in that. I haven't seen Darks in his sofa car yet. I wonder if it's quicker to go around the outside like that. Keep up the speed. Din might go. Ruffy's made the common mistake of bigger equals better and just makes you a bigger target. I mean, I suppose that's a fair point. I mean, I just wanted to race with a van, honestly. Oh, that was lucky. He's got a good vibe, that little thing. Get it, go up here and get a run off the corner to go faster. That's the line. Oh, there it's not. We're sticking with four laps on everything just to give everything a little bit of a taste, but yeah, we should definitely do something like that. When we do tracks like that, we'll do it for longer. Oh. This is going to be just carnage. I'm not gaining any positions and I'm going to get taken out at the crossover. I can feel it already. <laughs> Look at the state of this. All I'm going to do is lose time and then I'm going to get taken out at the crossover by the leaders. <laughs> tried to cut in when there's a barrier there. <laughs> oh, figure eight buses. Get out of the way. I'm coming through. Oh, he's gone. Oh, he's back again. <laughs> you wait ages for a bus and then 24 of them come around at once. <laughs> uh, it's getting closer to that time where the crossover is going to start coming in. Can't get away from the bottom position, still in 20. I think we found a good position location for the camera and stuff now, haven't we? Pretty good with that now. There's the leaders. I think it might be next time round.
<laughs> it's getting closer and closer. <laughs> oh no. Oh, it's definitely going to be next time around. Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, he was in the lead all the way through. <laughs> right at the end. Right at the end, he gets... <laughs> oh, my God. Leave me alone. Oh, I hate this game. Poor Caloran. He was right at the line as well. He was so close. He ended up finishing seventh. Ouch. Oh, God. <laughs> Everybody's got to do the jumps every lap. <laughs> and given, given how the first jump went, this is going to go swimmingly. Oh no, he's gonna come out and get. Oh no! Someone skip the jump. Who's that in the blue? Jumps every lap, you scum. I saw. Ryder B got carbon. Got what he deserved for skipping the jump. <laughs> Instant karma. And that actually helped. I feel like I would have had a bigger crash if I had uh, hit it in there. I was not stable at the edge of that jump. <laughs> I tried, couldn't even, it just wouldn't slow down. It went up on two wheels and then just wouldn't slow. Bollocks. He skipped the jump again, I'm sure he did. God damn it. Thirteenth. Not quite as bad as the buses. <laughs> Although that's technically 12th, because we can exclude Ryder from the results for skipping the jumps. <laughs> first, first disqualification of Wreckfest stream. <laughs> Alright, slightly longer race. Slower cars at the front, faster cars at the back. I'm closer to the back than I am at the front. And this is going to be uh, interesting. God. I only lost one hit point from that. That could have gone a lot worse, I reckon. <laughs> There's people everywhere. Oh, I just couldn't make it. That's what I mean, when you've got no idea of, like, really the car's capabilities, the corner makeup, the track makeup, you just end up overshooting every single brake zone. <laughs> Trying to rein it in a little bit. It's an interesting tactic to take a slower car to start at the front, but the speed that we passed Benimi there, who was on pole position, like, I don't think it's a good idea to purposefully take a slower car just to start at the front. I don't think it's going to work. Especially for an eight lap race.
I'm hoping that I can catch up to these guys in front. I think they're quicker than me in the early stages. I'm, I think I've got quicker car, but I'm obviously needing to like learn the track and stuff and the car. I'm hoping I can like maybe push on for a top five in the later stages of the race. Oh, that's a good line that that mini just did, the red one. The brown one, not so much. It was a bit of a poopy line, to be honest. <laughs> See, these little, little tricks of the track that you learn. about that. Yeah. Almost completely botched that one. Alright, let's try this better line. Oh, he tried it a bit too hard that time. That's the line. You could have crossed the grass. Get it slowed a little bit. And away you go, we're up to sixth. Oh, there's crashes going on up ahead. Oh no! That was a back marker, so we're still in sixth. <laughs> Thank you, has been catching me for a while. I'm quicker on the straights though. Got the corner in grip though. <laughs> this is just good fun, isn't it? Like, this is just some proper good fun racing. Like, this is we've done the idea was you know, we've done four laps on. All the different types of track, you know, tarmac, dirt, mixed, figure eights, crazy crossover carnage, all that kind of stuff. Oh, there's that lawnmower. <laughs> um, and now this is more like a, a standard GTA race length would be. Sort of like closer to the 10, 15 minute mark. I had to avoid, but it sent me wide. Definitely slower off road. God, I'm on the fringes of a top five, I just can't do it. Didn't Din might take a, a slower car to get on pole position? He's done quite well to still be up here. But surely I can get him on like one of the straights, but then oh, there's, a, there's a load of cars at the minute all vying for positions. I'm still in sixth. I can't get away from sixth. I mean, I can, I can feel how like how I need to learn so much like when you see the, the quicker guys and how they're being quicker and you know I can I can recognize finally in fifth no I've gone too wide I couldn't get it slowed oh bollocks finally in fifth of course Alright, two more positions I need, I'm in seventh. I need to stop going wide. You lose so much time from it. And then you can't get it slowed down for the next corner if you're still wide. I've lost a lot of time now. 
got to keep it on the on the tarmac. I don't think a top five is going to happen. There might have to be some crashes. There already has been crashes. I just haven't been able to take advantage of it. I've been having my own issues. No, no, no. God damn it, Benny, and your bloody stupid huge pink. <laughs> I thought he was going to come back, and then he stopped. So I went to the right, but then he came back anyway. <laughs> okay, top five's definitely not happening anymore. <laughs> that ship has well and truly sailed. No! No! Oh. Disappointing. Much to learn though. I think a top five was possible, as always. You know, top five is always possible. It definitely was in this, but I had a few bad laps towards the end. I screwed it for myself. Oh. <laughs> Damn. It's just it's just so much fun in it. 